but let's have a good production. I appreciate everybody being here and dedicating your guys' time and your weekend. What makes these uh, shoots successful is our experience and our expertise in basically event type filmmaking. So even though today we're building an actual set, it's still kind of event filmmaking because we're working with amateurs. Uh, although they've practiced and everything, there's no telling what can happen, so we have to be able to adjust especially when they start getting tired. Um, so it's very important for us that we're capturing it the right way, that we have our, we're using our knowledge, and honestly shoot this the least amount of time as possible. All right, how are you feeling? Good. Besides cold and windy? Yeah. Good, good, I'm excited. I'm a little nervous, I don't I'm know I'm more excited about, or nervous about this than I am about the actual wedding. Wedding. Yeah. Like I want this to be like perfect. But you are perfect. Oh my god, I know. That's why I'm marrying you because you compliment me all day. All day. All day. The GNA Diary. The couple that we're shooting for is Harpreet and Kevin, a Punjabi uh, girl and an Asian guy. So it's a very unique thing for AVL. We've never shot a concept film for a mixed couple like this before. So it's been really interesting because uh, Kevin, who you'll fall in love with through this movie, he in real life loves Indian stuff more than his wife does, who is Indian. So he wants the Hindi lines in the movie. He wants Indian songs, he wants to dance. Uh, so they're just a really charming couple. And the reason why we took this with this particular client was because we felt that they could really live the role that we wrote for them and that they would enjoy themselves shooting this film the way we have it planned out. Tell me about the script, like the story. Well, um, so we go back to school, right? Back at Toro University where we first met. And everything's going fine. Uh, it's like a cherry old everything day, right? But then somehow I get kidnapped. Right. Suspense! Suspense! And then there's motorcycles and chase scenes. That's all I, that's all I wanted was motorcycles. Yeah. It didn't yeah. matter what else was in it. Kevin! Kevin, help me! Oh! <laughs> Don't push her into the window. Cut. <laughs> okay, you alright? <laughs> Medic! How much of this is based in uh, reality? Yeah. I, I get kidnapped on a frequent basis, so really, it's all true. It's, um, I wrote it from the heart. <laughs> I'm gonna say it happens a lot. Are your friends or family participating in this process? Yeah, we have some of our friends coming. A bunch coming. of friends coming to town. Um, and some of Kevin's cousins that live here locally. And um, everyone's really, really looking forward to it. So. When we make Bollywood concept films, it's important for the friends and family of the bride and groom to take part in it. It makes it more special. When you're watching this at your wedding reception and you see your friends, your brother, your sister, you see them in the actual film, it means so much more to you. And uh, most of these that we've shown, we get to be at the reception and watch the reaction and you'll see like little pockets of, oh, when they see a certain guy who maybe is the funny guy in the group, the funny brother or the funny cousin. And that's magic. I mean, for us, it's about them having a good time. These memories that they're going to make with their friends, family, cousins, whoever they invited to this, they're going to last forever. Far, far longer than this movie will even last. The locations for the shoot are, are pretty interesting. We're going to be all over the place. So tonight we're going to be at the beach. Tomorrow morning we're going to get some pickup shots for a Bollywood number at the beach. Try to get some mountain shots, things like that. But we're also shooting at a restaurant to emulate the couple's first date, which was at a restaurant. Most first dates are. And then we switch venues to actually to a nightclub, which is going to be where our Bollywood scene is shot. So there's going to be an entire nightclub setting, which is going to be awesome. And then we switch to Toro University, which is going to be a classroom setting. Toro University is, is where the story is based out of. It's actually where the couple met in medical school. And we're going to be on Mare Island for a good part of the weekend. The Mare Island is an old Navy base. It's, it's awesome. There's tons of like old abandoned warehouses and pipes and it's right on the water. So we have some really cool locations from glamorous beach to really shoddy, dingy, warehousing look. That's a great setting for an action movie. Today we have about four hours to shoot two flashback scenes. So I'm not too worried about it. Uh, really the heavy lifting starts this evening and tomorrow. And then we are headed to Sacramento and we have dance rehearsal with Tony, our choreographer, and the couple and their friends. So we we're shooting the opening title sequence uh, for the movie right now, which is uh, Kevin's Dream. It starts in a classroom, this very dingy classroom. Everybody gets bored in class. and goes to this magnificent world in the Carmel Valley where he actually proposed to her. So we we're just picking up some shots right now. The beach we were going to use is closed. So this is but this is part of uh, event filmmaking. So now we're gonna head to the beach and shoot on the sand and get some get some feet wet and uh, and have some fun. So awesome.
Why don't you tell us what's happening here? We're ready to go. Our confidence is up. We're excited. And uh, we should be good to go tonight. Uh, I'm Brandon, I'm DP, and we're getting ready to go shoot the first scene right now. I'm excited. I'm excited to finally get some film in the can. It's, we think it's cold here. Uh, I can't wait to see how the ocean's gonna be. It's gonna be chilly. We are on our way to 17, which is this really gorgeous road through Santa Cruz en route to Monterey, which is going to be where we shoot our proposal scene. It's a flashback for the movie, so we're going to be out on the beach tonight and get the sunset shot that we need. That would be, actually, that would be great if that could happen. So what you want to do is, like, I want you to just go down slower, yeah. and then after you know, how do all the two cameras feel? Cut. That's a cut. Cool. All right, guys. We got a lot. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we do it. That's cool. I love it. It's good. Yeah. Today is one of the most important days of the shoot. Today we're shooting our Bollywood dance number. Every time we have these big Bollywood dance sets, they're, they're part of my favorite to shoot because if you're making a Bollywood concept film, there's nothing more Bollywood than Bollywood dancing. So, uh, you know, it, it's, it's going to be super awesome. There's beautiful lighting there. It's a gorgeous dance floor that's going to give us a great backdrop for our dances. We um, what's about to happen is uh, ETA to starting the Bollywood scene 8, dance scene. I should say, is about uh, half an hour away. We're just waiting for some donuts and coffee, and then uh, we're gonna get this thing jamming. Lighting guys are rolling, sound guys rolling, and we're just finishing up a few touches on our camera equipment. I do mostly local choreography for Sacramento area. I, I go to Sac State right now. I'm in my last semester. You know, I've choreographed for kids, I've choreographed for, uh, for me, weddings, for me, things like that. The whole process has been amazing. Um, flew up, flew me out to Vegas, and uh, I had been Kevin in a heartbeat, and we worked for a whole day. You know, I got got to stay in the little Luxor Hotel. Mm -hmm. That was pretty awesome. And then uh, today, it was just been trying to get everything together, getting everybody to learn everything. It's just been crazy, but hopefully, once we start shooting, it's going to be all falling into place. So Tony and I planned for pretty much just watch the video, and then we took pieces out of that video with some pieces out of other videos that we liked. And then he would teach us a part, and then if we didn't like it, we'd be like, we need to tone it down and make it easy for the lay people. Um, it's like hip hop meet Bhangra. Yeah, that's totally what it is. Hip Bhangra. Let's see. For the Bollywood dancing, we're going to be capturing the entire sequence using three different cameras, and we're going to be using some cinematic gear like Dolly and Track, which allows us for some side to side movement, and we're also going to be using something called the Fly Cam which really allows us to make the camera feel like it's gliding. Those are standard Bollywood tricks that they use all the time. But the most important thing that we're using for the Bollywood dance though is the fan, because you have to have the hair blowing in, in, in the wind in order for it to be Bollywood. So I would say on this Bollywood dance set, the most important piece of equipment is the mole fan. We are here at beautiful Toro University. This is where Harpreet and Kevin met, and this is the first scene of the movie. Are you nervous about uh, knowing your lines? I am. A little bit. Sab ko jaa chata. Tumne bil... Oh god. Tumne... Tumne bil... Bil kool sahi kya. Acha? Si. Especially the... Uh... The, the, the Hindi stuff, uh, I can work with my accents and the right emphasis and the right syllable, so. You guys want me to do this right now? <laughs> I, yeah, no, I don't know. I have to read it. I have to memorize. And the 
funny thing is his Hindi lines are a million times harder than mine. Like his sentences are much longer. Like it's just mine are like very tiny and short and I can just memorize them. Hilarious. <laughs> Cross that bridge when we get there. Today we're just doing the, uh, the scene where uh, she gets uh, kidnapped and uh, what else are we doing? Tell them about the scene from the morning. Oh, this morning, and then where I, I I come out concerned and can't find her. And... Our break, our break. Hey. My friend Dan, I should receive a an Oscar nomination. I, I think at least best supporting. Actor. Best supporting actor, right? Yeah. Honestly. I don't know. Did you see anything suspicious? Uh, I saw a car roll by. It looked like an X5. Uh, they just took off. Uh, you see anybody in there? Just a bunch of people. I don't know. But uh, it was just us. Me being concerned, trying to find her, and pretty much chasing after her, and the uh, big action sequence is coming up still. Like the very first meeting, we met Rajan and Summit, and we were kind of figuring out what we wanted, and then Kevin was like, motorcycles! And they were all, they, and they were like, out. motorcycles! Yeah. And I was like, hello! So we're shooting a chase sequence at Mare Island uh, today, and it's actually a desolate Navy base that has been abandoned for quite a few years. So there's lots of cool, like, warehouses and rail depots and streets. I mean, this used to be a full-blown function in base before, so we're gonna be shooting an awesome chase scene here. And yeah, have some motorcycles, have a big grip truck, and oh yeah, we do, we're shooting with the platter today, which is gonna be exciting, so. Uh, we're almost at the end of the day here, I'm exhausted. I'm waving them in, let's do it. You're gonna see it live right here behind the scenes, baby. in a way, but um, you know, we wanted to get good shots and we wanted to do it in a timely fashion. It was it was still pretty fun. I mean, he showed us a couple of scenes and it looked a lot faster than I thought we were going. Because the slow scenes, when we said we want to go about 20, 25, 40 miles an hour, we're like, that's pretty slow. And how's it going to look fast? But we magic makes it happen. Brandon, how's your shot? Okay, let's do it. We got it! That is officially a wrap. There we go. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Cheers to our amazing crew. Cheers. And our amazing cast. Yay! Yay! Thank you. July 9th, 2011. Thank you. Woo! It's been fun. It's been fun. It's been like, I, I, we're really lucky that we met Raja. Like, super lucky. He's like, amazing. And he, like, you just feel like you're chilling with friends. Like, the whole, he's made everything just so much fun. I think this is really cool. It kind of shows the story of the couple and sort of in a film format. I think it'll be exactly like Harpreet wanted, a big Bollywood film. She's our little Bollywood actress. <laughs> you know, I've never dreamed of doing something like this. I never thought that I would be on like this huge production, you know, this wonderful production set with all these crazy lights and cameras and I'm like, all right, here we go, we gotta do this. You know, this is, this is like, I don't know, it's, it's weird, it's kind of surreal. What are you going to do with this um, movie when you're done? We're going to show it to everybody gonna, we know. I'm going to submit it to South by <laughs> What's that, South West? South, by, South by. Just, No, are South you thinking by? Sundance? Sundance. That's what no, you're... I want to do the small, the small one here that... in Aspen first. Is it the South? Babe, South that's... I would probably show it to everybody I know. Yeah. Like, I'd be like, you guys want to see what we're doing. And the funny thing is now that we're doing this, all of my friends who are getting engaged, I'm like, I have the best idea for you. Yeah, I want the video to be you know, published and, and, and all over the AVL website. That's, that's the main goal. <laughs> You're so retarded. They're going to remember these moments when they're goofing off, when they're having fun, and when they're working hard together. Um, I think my AD said it really good yesterday that, uh, you know, I never thought about it this way, but they're actually bonding with, their, with each other, the bride and groom, and with their family and friends. And I never thought about it that way, and sometimes your AD has to put you in check, but a really great way to think about it, that they're creating memories.